All right, folks, of course, uh, Red Carpet uh, Show took place prior to the Image Awards, and our cameras were there as well. Catch it up with all kinds of different folks, whether it was Anthony Anderson, Amari Hardwick, you name it. And so here's some of that stuff as well. We're with Reggie Hutley. He is the executive producer of the Image Awards. Uh, so, man, you got to help a show this year. It's a great show. But what makes a great show is great movies, great TV shows, great music, and that's what we got this year. Unlike other big award shows, if you join the NAACP, you can vote in all these categories. You can help decide who the winner is. You've been kind of quiet in the first three episodes of Scandal. Uh, I know the heat is going to have to come soon. Well, you know what? I think they've changed kind of the structure of the episodes so that they're concentrating on one character at a time. So my turn will come. You'll see. What else are you working on? Uh, Justice League comes out in November. Um, and then uh, hopefully um, turn me loose. Uh, turn me loose. If we don't make it to Broadway this year, we're definitely going to be in Chicago at the Goodman Theater this summer. Y'all, we here with wild man Michael Kaya. First of all, check out the red shoes. Oh, these old things. I mean, check out the red shoes. Now, now you see, top. now you see, I had to hit him with the pink. What? You know, I had to hit him with the pink. You know. I started to do something flamboyant on the socks. I didn't know it was going to go that far. <laughs> Brother, thank you for being here and thank you for being you. We don't have enough strong black voices like yours to speak up for us and stand up for us. Whenever it goes down, you stand right up, brother. You don't never bite your tongue. And I love you for that. I salute you for that. Well, I appreciate that. And you, you, don't, you do the same thing on the comedy stage. I'll be trying to do it, man. And now drama, too. You know, I just did my first one-man show. It's called Michael Kaya's Mama. If you like your mama, you're going to love this show. We're doing 100 cities. We're going to hit every major city there is. So look for us, man. Last night, Anthony Anderson could have picked up another image award for best host. But I won. Was I nominated last Yes, you night? were. You and Tracy were nominated for Best Host. This, I knew this damn show was rigged. <laughs> and I saw, I, I saw the post your wife, but making room for your third. <laughs> making room for your third. That's good. That's good. You know, right. you know, I, Congratulations. Well, I appreciate you, it, baby. All right, baby. Only real, true gentlemen know how to rock an ascot. Ascot Nation, baby. I'm just saying. Some, some, Not many will be flowing through here tonight with this look. Somebody got to do it. It's very nice to be joining you on the beautiful NAACP carpet. This right, is such right. an honor. Mighty colorful here. Such such a colorful. And I must say that I am joining the TV One family. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's got uh, media coming on. What, what you doing on the, in the movie? Uh, causing a lot of havoc. Yes, I portray Danielle Jones. And, of course, it is inspired by Miss Kathy Hughes. By no means is it a documentary. What I keep telling people is that if it were a documentary, she would be arrested right now. She would not be walking the carpet. But this has been her passion project for some years now. So to be a part of the amazing cast that helped breathe life into these characters has been such an amazing blessing. And tune in February 25th, 8, 7 Central, only on TV One. And you guys will not be disappointed. All right, folks, uh, we're here with the man. Uh, he has been crazy busy. It is the most busiest museum in D.C., a new Smithsonian Museum, African-American culture. The man who uh, sweated hard to get it open, Lonnie Bunch, and he's been honored, of course, with the Chairman's Award. I'm so honored. It's so great to be with you. This is really wonderful to have the NAACP recognize the importance of history. Uh, and, of course, uh, NAACP is a huge part of that museum. Well, you can't tell the history of America without telling the story of the NAACP. So all of the 20th century has been shaped by the NAACP. And not only that, of course, uh, Dizel Washington, his wife, Paulette, will be here. Uh, and they raised a couple of dollars for your museum. Well, they were so kind to host, and the, ho the gathering they hosted raised $17 million, just a little bit That's of change. That's it, just $17 million. Omar, finally, there's a movie... As a show, well, I ain't gonna talk about him like a dog, because when he was on, when y'all, when he was on uh, Ray Donovan, I was killing Omar. Every day on Twitter, every day. I was like, I'm glad Roland get to see me playing a regular human being, so he ain't got a dump on me like he like to do. Well, and the thing about your role on Queen Sugar is, really, your blue-collar brother showing what love is about. Right, exactly. It's um, a real man. You know, it's, that's why I'm, it's really good that Ava wrote that role. Because she said, I want to reflect what real men look like to me. Congratulations. I appreciate you know, it. He won last night. He won last night an Image Award for his work in journalism and what he's doing on TV One. I'm so proud of him because he's been my guiding light for a long time. Well, I appreciate it. Since 2007. But now we need you again. And we need to like figure out what we're going to do 
how we're going to stand because this is some scary times right now. We're going to swing every day. We don't even take a weekend off. Every day, but you got to call me and tell me where I need to be and when. Okay. I see Justin. We embrace. He said, look at here. I'm going to talk to you afterwards after I lose this award to Joe Morton. Then all of a sudden, you win. I know. I'm so excited. But it was good. This because last, last year, y'all, we literally are in the middle of an interview. And they're like, Jesse, you won again. And he went, for what? Yeah. It was for, like, all the music awards. But this was this is my first award that I've ever won for acting. So Really? Yeah, ever. So it, this is really exciting. This is special. So last year was a first? This year first? I mean, you just like a first. Any new first next year? I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Image Awards, what y'all got for me next year? Kickstart your day at 7 and get the news you need from the perspective you want. News One Now with Roland Martin. Every weekday morning at 7 on TV One.